You've tuned in to the Top 10 Gardener with garden expert, Ken Lane. Join him daily as he answers timely garden questions that are sure to make a difference in your garden. Now welcome your host, Ken Lane. So there is a problem in the garden world. And that problem, for gardeners mainly, uh, for the, here's what's happening is we are planning our crop rotation. That is, what plants will we have? Usually a year to two years. The trees are five, seven, eight, ten years ago. We're finally having them in now. And so these are very finite crops. And farmers, we don't want any left over because they just go to the mulch pile. It's just not sustainable. It's not organically correct. It just just more things to spray, take care. It's just, it's better to call it short and run out than to have to put them in the mulch bin or something. So uh, we, we purposely try to run out. Well, that causes an issue if you want a new variety of lilac or crepe myrtle or uh, camellia, whatever that new fancy fun, the core things. Okay. Yeah. There's always junipers or red tip potinia. They never run out because there's literally thousands of them planted boxwood. It's ridiculous. When you go to the farm, there's thousands of them. But if you want something unusual, like Christmas cactus, this is a finite season for those, uh, holiday cyclamen. If you want a uh, cute little, Alberta spruce for the holidays at your front door, uh, uh, hollies. I'm talking uh, um, uh, carnivorous plants, uh, your pitcher plants. These are very limited. And so frequently we'll have them at the garden center and they're out within days. We, we thought we had enough. We weren't sure. And we thought we had two weeks supply and it ends up being a three day supply. And so we're, we're starting to allow our core customers, those folks that or one of us, we're giving them exclusives. We go, hey, this is coming. Three weeks out, we're going to have this crop of plants. So Christmas cactus are coming. It's a bigger variety. You don't have to settle for the cheesy four-inch size. You can go with six, eight-inch. The poinsettias are going to be rare, like not red, but super burgundy, spotted, striped marble. New varieties, the newest varieties. We're going to allow folks to kind of jump the line and and pre-order those and go, just, look, I want one, have it waiting for me. When they're here in three weeks, I want it. And so we call them plant drops. We're going to start next week with a Christmas cactus, kind of a holiday collection. So we're switching into holiday mode. And so we're going to have cyclamen. Uh, I mean, not just cyclamen. You know, I'm, I'm going to call it whiskey star, kind of whiskey row. It's red with a white star in the middle. It is so cool and it screams holiday and it goes with a Christmas cactus. Not just any cactus, a big six, I mean, get beefy, perfectly budded, ready to open up for the entire holiday season. We call them plant drops. We're gonna have this next week. We're gonna share, feature that out there so that, well, folks that want them, they, I'll have them at the store, but I have a feeling these really specialized crops they're going to be pre-sold and there won't be any left. So it'll be through your email or, or phone phone feeds. You'll, you'll see them. That's kind of a new thing. And we're trying to get that. I've got one. Uh, I'm talking to a grower. It's got the most beautiful carnivorous plants I've ever seen. You cannot find these. We're not talking just a cheesy, you know, I mean, talking big, beefy, glorious ones. It'll be only available by plant drop. I, I might have a few here left, but basically... They're so specialized. There's so few. You've got to pre-order them if you really want that. If that's of interest, go to watersgardencenter.com. At the front of our page, you'll see Lisa and I pop up, and you can sign up and go, let me know. I want to be one of the first to know. And you might not be interested in all of those, but some you would. A new lilac, a new crepe myrtle, a new, a new camellia. That might be just your thing, but plant drops here at Waters Garden Center. Throughout the week, Lisa and I camp out here at Waters Garden Center. We love talking to fans of the show. Waters companion plants that grow well together are blaze maple, burning bush, spicy mums, glamour kale, and red wall creeper. Waters red wall creeper is specially selected to dress up those miles of stockade fence. A mountain vine with rich green foliage turns fire engine red through autumn. Waters native vines are just and both deer and rabbit proof. You'll find the showiest vines here at Waters Garden Center. Google, give me directions to Waters Garden Center.
If you want a more fruitful garden, increase success in landscape that just feels better, then tune in daily to the Top 10 Garden Podcast. Years of tips, tricks, and garden shortcuts are guaranteed to make your gardens nicer than ever. Listen to this podcast or read Ken's weekly garden column by visiting watersgardencenter.com. That's waters with two T's, gardencenter.com. Thanks for tuning in.